Good morning and welcome to one of my first days out of quarantine. I'm so excited to get out of the house. And yes, I did make a banana bread during quarantine. The only one I've made since March. Today is really exciting because I get to see one of my best friends. I haven't seen her since even before the lockdown. She is currently more immunocompromised. So today was kind of like the one day that we feel the most safe being together. All the rest of the time, I'm going to have to be at least six feet from her. This is also the only time I'm able to go into her apartment and play with her cats and just hang out together like we normally would be able to. Hey. Is it good to be back in the city or how are you feeling about it? Yeah, it's like, it's going to be weird, I think, tomorrow because like I'll be taking public transit being and out yeah, being and out and like home. picking up a kid from school. Yeah. So that's going to be strange. Yeah. And it's been just weird also just being in the apartment alone. Yeah. Oh, Henry. <laughs> her and her mom took such good care of my plants while I was away. They grew so much. They even have new growth coming in and I don't even recognize them anymore. We're touching. We can be together. <laughs> I know. I'm like, we need to get it all in now while we can. Yes. So we just we'll walk like this. Okay. That good. Our plans on this day were all over the place, but I really only cared about spending time together. So honestly, we could have been doing anything. We ended up getting a really delicious brunch that we split three ways, so we got the best of everything. And then we just spent the rest of the day chilling out together. Hey, good morning. It's Saturday and I just did my laundry. You can see some of it hanging up and drying behind me. It's my first time doing laundry since quarantine, since I got back here, which is it's been three weeks. I was really putting it off. I just didn't feel like doing it during the week. I had like no motivation to get it done before work. I'm starting to get my life a little bit on track um, post quarantine. I also finally was able to pick up um, my paint packages that had gotten lost and then they were just being held at the post office and at like a UPS pickup point. So I finally got those so I can finally start to catch up on some of my homework. This guy's full of clean clothes and there's some more in here. All right, let's start folding it. So it's much later in the day, it's about 6.30. I have to go in a second, uh, but I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's and I'm hoping that it's not too busy. I hope I'm not in line that long. I also trimmed my bangs, which is good. I've been meaning to do that for a while. And um, so semi-productive day. Yay, I'm back. The line was long. It wrapped around the corner of the block, but it only took like 10 minutes. So really not a big deal. I just watched some TikToks and everything fit in my trolley. And then the extra things I just shoved in my backpack because it was pretty empty. I'm going to begin unpacking and sorting everything and I'll show you what I got. I also threw my mask into this little bowl with a little splash of detergent. My other mask I was wearing earlier is in there so I like to wash them pretty much right away. I like I just take it off and throw it right into that bowl and that way they are clean and dry within the next day and a bit. I shoved a bag of salad in here. Okay, that doesn't that doesn't want to focus. There's some green tea. Ooh, my smashing s'mores. There they are. These look so fun. Chocolate mousse pumpkins. It's a little chocolate cake layered with mousse. And then there's like orange icing on it. I don't know. That sounds really good. I got this, a little hot chocolate stirring spoon kind of thing with marshmallows. The girl checking me out said it was really good. Some pasta, a 
pumpkin spice a pumpkin <laughs> and a little a little gourd friend so there's my little white pumpkin and i really like this one it's all knobbly and then part of it is like stripey i thought that was really cool okay so that's all of the items that were in here <laughs> um also very funny i got home and noticed i already had a pumpkin pie spice and i have not even opened that one so i might return the new one i got or i might just keep both i don't know i don't really think i need that much pumpkin spice but we'll see a harvest apple salad kit this just sounded really good okay i think these are all the rest of the pumpkins that i got i got another white one this one has a nice stem i thought that was cute i got this little like stripy orange and white one very pretty i wanted to get more but and then a little knobbly gourd very cute lots of colors it kind of looks like a candle or something i don't know the shape of it I like them. These are nice because I can use them as um, decorations and they're pretty cheap. I don't have to worry about like storing them in the future. They will just rot and then I'll get rid of them. <laughs> this is a seasonal item, the butternut squash mac and cheese. I got two, I'm hoping that it's gonna be good. Um, I saw some reviews online and they said it was good. I got some Israeli couscous. I got some kiwis. Hopefully they're ripe enough. I feel like kiwis are just starting to not be as good anymore. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm excited about this. These are so good, okay? I made them at home. They get gigantic. <laughs> like, they get so big. The chocolate in them is really nice. They get really, really nice and flaky. It's probably the best deal money-wise if you want pain chocolat. You can make four of them for the same price as you would get for one in a bakery. I got a black bean and Monterey Jack burrito. It's very basic, but it's very good and it crisps up really nicely in the oven. I got some mango mochi. I really like these. Um, they're nice when you want something sweet and like just a little bite. I also got some frozen mango chunks. Um, wow, they're really melting. Uh, these are good for smoothies, but I also wanted to try to make my own kind of boba drink. That's why I got the green tea as well. Hopefully this is fine. But I really like a mango green tea milk tea. I wanna order some boba or buy it at the store, but ordering it off Amazon is probably going to be easier. I'm a big fan of these because I am a child. They are drinkable little yogurts. I really like the strawberry one. I think this one's my favorite, but I also got the little wild berry one. I got the last two chai concentrates that they had out for the night. This is my favorite chai. All I have to say about that, really. I just always need it on hand. I got some mushrooms. I'm gonna make risotto. I got an apple juice because it's my recent juice obsession. But this is probably my favorite juice from Trader Joe's. It's the orange peach mango one. I don't drink coffee, so it's kind of nice to have like a variety of different beverageinos. Did somebody say beverageinos? Did somebody say beverageinos? What a lovely evening. I wish the girls were here for a beverageino. Did someone say beverageino? 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 Someone say beverageino? Someone say beverageino? <laughs> and then I got an oat milk. I haven't had this oat milk in a while, and I think it's my second favorite to oatly. Yeah, I literally ran out of oat milk earlier today, so this is perfect, and it's cheaper than oatly, so we love that. Then I got the maple oat milk. I tried this um, at my friend's house, and it smells so good, and I thought that it might be nice with the chai to give it like a little something different. I think that's everything. I'm so excited to eat some of this. Um, I'm gonna have a little snack. I don't know what yet. I can't wait to find some spots for these guys. They're so cute. I'm gonna try one of these little pumpkin cake 
Moose cake, guys. This is what it looks like on the inside. Moose cake and then chocolate on the outside, I think. You definitely only need one. <laughs> They're pretty rich. Eat my pumpkin and hold my pumpkin. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. It was really nice to get out of the house. If you like this video, you can give it a like and subscribe for more videos and turn on the bell so you know every time that I post. All right, see you in the next one. Bye.